Welcome to the Blockchain Report. We discuss all things blockchain technology, digital assets, DeFi, NFTs, and much more. Today's video, we're diving into the Atleta Network campaign, the Atleta Olympia, and I've been getting a lot of requests, a lot of requests to cover Atleta. So thank you to everyone who has been commenting on YouTube. Um, I know I've been getting a lot, so your requests have not gone ignored. So thank you for bringing this to my attention. And yeah, it's a layer one EVM compatible blockchain tailored for the sports industry with native DeFi apps, interoperability integration, and secure massive data layers. So we have so a little a little quest or a little campaign thing to go through, and they have a leaderboard. So we will dive into all the quests that they have in this, from the faucet, staking, swapping, all kinds of fun stuff. So before we actually get started, thank you so much for joining. Please like, subscribe, comment, share this out to anyone you think would be interested in blockchain technology, all the fun stuff we get to learn, and cool rewards we earn along the way, like these test nets, which which most can give you some incentives. Some don't really do so much as give you a few cents, but it is what it is. Some projects are heavily backed and will give you a good airdrop if you stay active. It's all about being consistent, at least multiple transactions a week. If you can, do it daily. But uh, also, we do have a Discord. That if you have any questions, comments, please jump out or jump in there and reach out to us. Link is in the description below. We got a lot of amazing people in the community that can help answer pretty much any question you have. And if not, we know the right place to, to send you. So thank you to everyone in there helping out. We're doing a whole revamp. Everything's we're, we're making some upgrades and changes. So everyone working on the back end on that. Thank you so much. Y'all are awesome. And with that, Let's get started. So the day has come. They made some updates to their Atleta Olympia test net as of the other day in this video. Oh, 10 days ago. No. Oh, 20 days ago. Sorry. I thought this was uh, shared on the 20th. <clears throat> so 20 days ago. <clears throat> so they're enhancing their experience. The, they've enhanced, enhanced the experience to the test net with a leaderboard and quest navigation. They have referral program, leaderboard, and easy navigation for both new and additional quests. Non-custodial platform that facilitates transfer and assets across different blockchains, the bridge, and the governance interface. So I will share my referral link in the description. We're going to go in here and sign up. We're going to start on the Sepalia network. That way, do we need to get the faucet first? So we will receive, so you can receive 10 times more from the faucet if you supply an email. So what we are going to do is supply that and put in the code that they send you. Okay, so send me the tokens. Okay, now that we have the Atleta, we need to bridge because we don't have any funds in the Atleta network. Okay, it will add our chain automatically. Should do it in uh, MetaMask if you have that. Okay, so Sepalia, yeah, we'll bridge because we don't, we can only bridge the Atla token. So you want to bridge some to Sepalia since there's none over there already. So we're going to bridge some Atla token, confirm these transactions and confirm. So this is complete. If you switch, you should. It has not been fully received yet. So we will wait for that now. So we'll check out the leaderboard. Okay, we joined the test net. We're going to connect our X account. And there we go. Wallet verification, connect Discord. And I don't have an invite code, but I'm sure I can find one on here. I'm just going to use this first person. So, so my referral, um, I'll share my link in the description. So connect wallet, send a transaction, which is what we've done. Claim Atla tokens, which we already have. Oh, your transactions a month ago. Wow. Okay. I guess I can claim that again. So four minutes ago, let's refresh this and see if it changes. No. Okay. So stake and then governance and bridge. So let's stake. So we've asked for the faucet. Now we can stake some tokens. Term 50. Oh no, we'll do 10. Okay. And the term is in days. So let's, we'll do a hundred. And you do need some Atlet tokens for gas fees since they don't use Ethereum on this network. There we go. And then you can add to your stake. We'll just click on this. So by, so how do you add to your stake? Unbond, no, I don't want to do that. So stake now, huh? So I don't see an option to increase. There's just, I'm not sure what the deal is, but let's see if this increases it. Okay. That increased the time right here. So it looks like 10 days is the max. Okay. And then unstake. So we will unbond, hit the maximum. 
And what does this say? It'll take about two error period. Okay, so I'm just going to do half. And there's your fees, request, receive. Bada bing, bada boom. This one's looking pretty smooth, man. This little test net looking pretty smooth. So we'll unbond and we'll check out. Oh, no, that's the explorer. So leaderboard, we'll go back here. So announcements. Yeah, it looks like some of these will need to... I think it might need to refresh. Minimum seven days to qualify. Okay, so keep that in for seven days. And then governance, we'll move on to the governance. So vote and support, vote against, and submit a proposal. So here we are on the governance page. And discussion, view all, voting. So we will vote for on one of these. And we go back, and, and then we will vote against on this one, just because we want one of each. We voted and total votes um where is it at and submit a proposal so where do we go create a proposal um discussion referendum hmm or treasury which one let me let me take a look at this again okay looks like we must do a discussion there we go add pool to discussion general Allow everyone on chain verified. Create post. Submit. There we go. So I've created my my um, little thing here. So we got the XP coming in. Oh, just for those. What else did I have? So we staked. We've added stake. We've claimed uh, unstaked. We voted in support. Voted against. Submitted a proposal. And we've bridged to Sepalia, but we have not bridged to Atleta. So. Let's do that real quick, and this should have 10 Atleta on the Sepalia network. No, so it looks like they're still having issues, but make sure when you do receive your Atleta here that you bridge it back. So I have 10, so I'll bridge 10 back into Atleta. I might bridge five because I want to keep some on Sepalia, but there you go. Check out the government governance um, like we did before. This is your oh Atleta Olympia. So governance, staking, and DEX. So this is a uh, this is actually re like really simple to go through. Really awesome. And these should oh we have more. Oh look at that. We got a little hidden one. Okay. And so claim rewards from the staking, and also wait 24 hours or yeah after you unstake, you want to stake again. So do that if you want to wait your seven days and then do it. But Remember, you do have these two other ones to go through. So let's check the staking if they have. Okay, unbonding, two arrows, um, and then you can claim. So once that's done, you can come in and hopefully these points will, or this XP will, will rack up for you. But pretty simple so far. They make it really easy and user friendly. I like this much better to navigate than the movement test net, but if you do need any help navigating this or have any technical issues, please reach out to us on Discord. Link is in the description below. And with that, this is the Blockchain Report. Have a wonderful day, homies. Peace.